The 4.6 update is coming soon, and it will be very content-rich. Hoyoverse has really put effort into the 4.6 update and Arla Kino, so in this video you will find out all the details about what awaits us in version 4.6. Let's start with the main event of version 4.6 and the free rewards. It will take place in Inazuma, and traditionally, main events either award players a free 4-star weapon or a free 4-star character. For version 4.6, it will be the free character. Given the pattern of recent updates, namely, we will be given a free Goru. We also have the return of the rhythm game, which means we'll get a new instrument for free, and this time it will be the trumpet. Now let's talk about the Arlecchino. In the last beta, she was buffed, and now she has some really cool animations and abilities. Now Arlecchino can fly above the ground without taking damage from enemies during the charged attack, and it's safe to say that the Arlecchino is a character worth to pull. Now let's move on to the banners. They have undergone some quite serious and unexpected changes recently. If the leaks turn out to be true, then Hoyaverse no longer considers Farina an Archon, as all Archons are rerun through four patches after their release. But according to the latest information from reliable sources, Farina will not receive a rerun in version 4.6. In the first half of version 4.6, we will see Arlecchino and Liney, and in the second half, we will see Wanderer and Baiju. Unfortunately, this information may turn out to be true, as these same sources accurately indicated banners of versions 4.4 and 4.5. As for the chronicled Wish banner, there is currently no information on which characters might be featured there. From the latest old speculations, which are likely fake, the chronicled Wish banner for version 4.6 will feature characters from Liu. However, it is more likely that in version 4.6, we may not see the chronicled Wish banner and it will appear in version 4.7 instead, as version 4.6 has no connection to Liu and the main event of the version. Also in version 4.6, we can expect new artifact sets that will be perfect for Arlecchino. One of the artifact sets is tailor-made for her unique ability kit. The other set appears to buff the burning reaction for Dendro. And given that no Dendro characters have yet been made to specialize in burning, it's highly probable that the set is intended for Emily, a rumored Fontaine character expected to release in version 4.8. In the 4.6 update, we will also see a new area that will be divided into two parts, above ground and underground. The underground part will be called Remuria and strongly resembles Enkonomiya. At the moment, this is all the information we know about the 4.6 update. The update itself will be very interesting and will bring many innovations, and fortunately there is very little time left until its release. What do you think about the 4.6 update? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and bye everyone.